Welcome, welcome, welcome to story time with me, Miss Sheila. I hope you're having a wonderful and beautiful day. Today's story is called What If? <gasps> what if what? Let's find out. Might be some questions. With a pencil and paper, I write and draw art to create many stories that come from my heart. Oh, do you do that? Do you write and create? That'd be cool to see. But what if that pencil one day disappeared? Oh, good question. What if the pencils disappeared? I'd fold up the paper till stories appeared. Look at, so she's making origami. Look at, she made like a unicorn or something. Oh, an airplane. And what if that paper was no longer there? I chiseled a table and then carved the chair. <laughs> And what if there wasn't a chair here at all? I'd chip and I'd peel at, at the paint on the wall. Oh my goodness. She's creative. She made the sun. And what if there wasn't a wall anymore? I might build a story from boards in the floor. Without any floor, I could still use the land and sketch out a tail in the dirt with my hands. Look at she's made the universe and then a rocket ship. It goes seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, blast off. I could still shape the leaves. She made the leaves into a dragon. I could still sculpt the snow. True. And look, looks like she made the um a snowman out of marshmallows here with toothpicks and then an igloo out of ice cubes. Very clever girl. I could still plant the flowers and make kingdoms grow. See? And she made a sand castle. Without any land, I would still use the light. Invent shadow stories the sun would ignite. Ooh, ooh, ooh. If there was no light, I would still use my voice to sing out my stories, to chant and rejoice. Wow. I'd still have my body to twist and to bend, to dance out my stories beginning to end. Look at her dancing away. Oh, if I had nothing but still had my mind. I have to turn the pages. Ooh, ooh, look at it. Let's see what it says on the other side. It says there'd always be stories to seek and to find. She's flying on the unicorn. If I know nothing but one bit of fate. Mm, as long as I live, I will always create. See, she's creating at her table. As long as I live. There she's in her window. And look at this person's playing the violin and this person's decorating a cake. I will always create. Whoa. Isn't that pretty cool? Wow. And that's the end of the story. So I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope you go create and be adventurous. Until next time, with me and Sheila. Keep shining your light bright. Bye for now.